Holy wild gods and goddesses, what a week we've got in store for you. You may think I always say that, but listen to this. We have Mars sextiling Jupiter. It is one of the luckiest times. We also have Mars conjunct Poloto making it stormy and deep. We have Venus changing signs and Sun trying Saturn. Well, you're in for a treat. Here's your weekly astrology. Leo, you are intent on sorting things out, clearing things up and getting on and transforming. You're also quite the social butterfly this week. When Mars sextiles Jupiter, you have great attention to detail. Also, you're determined to overhaul your health and well-being and Jupiter could bring you a lot of luck through someone in your family. Also, if you want to move this year or transform your space, you got it. Jupiter has got your back. And whatever's going on in that area now, Mars is helping you have the passion, the strength and the physical energy to get things done. Venus is also shifting signs and making you really want to mix with people. You are a wow in the crowd. Get out and about and some good fortune is coming your way. You're very impressive at the moment. People like to have you around. Groups of people love to work with you and collaborations should be epic. In fact, if you're single, or even if you're not, if you get out and about, there's likely to be a very deep uh, attractions and um, affinity with people. You're feeling at one with groups at the moment. With Venus Sextile Chiron, it may be through a group or with a group, there's some travel or adventure, but certainly you are spreading your wings and you are healing yourself when it comes to anything to do with foreign travel, learning and branching out. You're, you're very philosophical and you're also examining where your philosophy of life has got you so far. We have Mars conjunct Pluto in your health and well-being sector. Try not to be a control freak this week. If you are frustrated around that day, you're likely to kick off and tell someone in minute detail what it is about them that's so annoying. Uh, it's very good for you to break through, though, and feel freer in yourself when it comes to your body. With the Sun trine Saturn on the 29th, a real breakthrough around work. You are nailing something. The missing piece of the puzzle is there, and it's almost as if it's a magic key to the next phase for you. And you're building up money, you're building up opportunity that's going to be, or could be, long-lasting. It's up to you to use the energy but the universe is encouraging you and giving you sort of hints, tips, and hopefully little breakthroughs. Take care, gorgeous, and I'll speak to you soon.
Hello, wonderful one. Thank you so much for listening. It would be fabulous if you liked, subscribed or shared. It would be really, really helpful. Also, I have a ton of free stuff for you. Horoscope.co.uk for everything astrology and michellenight.com for everything psychic and free tarot reading. See you there.